What? You wipe it down. And then what? And then it gets clean. It's like wet for like a month. A month? It's like a cotton couch. It wasn't gonna, you weren't gonna, you can't just clean that. You have to like. You unzip, oh, well that's the, okay. You unzip the covers and then you. Those weren't covers, the inside was just cotton. All right, well then maybe I'm stupid. I don't know. <laughs> All right, we got, we got snake clean versus a couch Ryu. and the set starting. All right. You know what? I want to talk about this. No, I'm just kidding. All right, we got. No, I want to admit. I want to convince you that I was right. Oh, time. what? That was right, fast. What? That was way too fast. But he's not gonna get that much damage. That was yeah. That was real fast. I'm definitely. I played against Coco once before, and I'm definitely because I play Game and Watch. I sit in shield a lot, <laughs> so I was like, I already know that this character has some dumb shield break potential. So I was like, I'm gonna make sure that, that doesn't happen, but. Wow, I can't believe that literally just happened in the first 10 seconds. Yeah, yeah. Coco Blunts uh, notably likes to focus way too much. Uh, yeah. That's well, like his biggest habit, to be honest. Yeah, well, you, you almost think, like, was that a bad idea? What? Breaking shield that early, because, you yeah. know, you didn't really get a lot of, you just got, like, percent out of it. You got good percent. I mean, I give Good percent for sure, but you definitely want to save that for later, like, when you really need the stock and you see him holy shield that hard. Right, like, so that's when you... I don't know, I feel like you save it for then. Well, to be fair, uh, D12 started the match with shield and kind of just wasn't expecting that much shield pressure. Gets There's the dash, dash attack, back. gets the toe. That's Taunt. definitely the kill. All right, nice. He's feeling himself. Taking first stock. Yeah. That's super exciting, man. Seeing him out here. Now he's putting on the pressure. He's definitely, yeah, now that he's ahead, doesn't really have to approach that hard. He can really start oh, to. Oh, nice. What's the punish? Gets there we it. go, more percent. Nice. Yes. Ooh. Oh, man. Wow, 77 on him already. That, oh, that's going to take the going to find the stock. That's why PS2 is so strong for Snake. It just does platforms. You just can't be above or underneath it or on it. It just covers so much stage. Yeah, just from attack. a single attack. Gets the jab lock. Not going to be the. Oh, there's going to oh, be the down tilt wow. to Tatsu. That's going to take it. All right. Look at this. I was not expecting him to get hit by that, to be Man, honest. Man, that, wow, that grenade eats the whole shock at us. That's crazy. Grenade, like, trades with everything. Grenade has some just insane priority, bro. It, it doesn't make sense. Like, I mean, in, in like, reality, it makes sense. If you got a grenade, I think that, I would hope that would trade with things. But Punch the grenade and you're fine. I yeah. Don't, yeah, I doubt it. But it's, like, stark contrast. Think about, like, arc fire priority. Right. And, like, how central to the game plan of both those characters it is. And, like, how much better grenade is because of just how much priority. Oh, uh, trying to get a shield break of his own. D12 not quite going to get it. Goes back. all for it all with the down air. He's not comfy in this matchup. Should be dead. You could have fooled me. And he's dead. He's gone. He's deceased. Wow. Coco Blunts. That is not the way I expected that first match to go. Honestly, I thought it could have gone either way, but... Oh way my closer. Lord. I that thought it was gonna be way closer. That was uh I I'm s i am mean like I know it's Ryu, but Jesus man. I'm yeah, surprised no he was just evaporated. You give a match. Oh I'm Oh you're on deck next. Oh okay. Wait, we're oh, gonna okay. be oh. For sure. Uh who am I playing? <clears throat> Yo, Jack? Who am I playing? Daddy, you're playing Zaddy? Ugh. Heavies. Makes my soul hurt just a little bit. Oh, yeah. Didn't you say that earlier? Did they? I don't know. Oh, I think they were talking about you. And Heavies. you just weren't paying attention. I, 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 what? Tell me right now why my wife's sending me memes. Is she watching <laughs> the stream? No, she's just sending me memes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going into game two. Battlefield. I know D12 loves this stage. Not too surprised that he picked this stage. Feels comfortable underneath the platform, and he can do this. And of course, after that first game, uh, I'm sure he's gonna try to, a different game plan here and just go for a little bit more of a camping, uh, waiting out approach here. That's what I would anticipate at least. Frame one aid. Yeah, you cannot. Nice, going to punish. Yeah. And the shield, oh, am I commentating by myself? Let's go. Here just comes out all the utility from Snake. Snake though. And a trade with the Tatsu, that parry is insane. All right. Oh, the top flat. Oh, look who it is. Look who it is. D12 definitely looking a lot more confident in this game. There's no uh, first 10 second shield break. That Spot dodges that down switch. Yeah, that did happen last game. <laughs> like, uh, 
Coco Bunch just came right in and hit him with that uh, Dragon S twice in a row, and he was oh. dead. Or his shield broke. All right, first stock coming out. D12 adapts so well. Like, it almost, like, you know, the first game matters in the sense that now D12 has to win two more. But yeah. he's, like, already caught on so much to all this stuff. But part of it is definitely, I think, this counter pick was a bit of an oversight from uh, Coco Bunch. Like, this is a rough stage to play against Snake on. He's not back? Wow. Unfortunate SD. And I can see that Ryu really wants to play on the ground quite a bit, except for like when he has, if you're already at 130. But before that, you know, yeah. he wants to hit you with the ground combos, and, and Snake is perfectly happy jumping on the platforms and putting yeah, exactly. out a C4s. Yeah, yeah, I see it. And I see him here. Yeah, gonna play low profile a lot more. All right. Crawled under the fireball. It's so rude. All right, let's see what he's got here. And yeah, I'm gonna fit. You know, uh, now that D12 has this lead, he's definitely fine to just stay back, hit him up with the, uh, use those grenades, use those Akitas, just really play Snake's trapping game here. It seems to be working quite well. <laughs> Double parry real quick. And then focus right through his Nair. Nice. Good projectile use here coming out from Koga Blunts. I mean, this really? lead trap is good, but he, he's gonna have to convert to a kill once he gets into that critical percent. Nice. Oh, I thought he was going to air dodge off stage there. That back air. Joryu. Dio's going to find that attack. Ooh, that that hitbox. Oh, got through it with the, oh, there we go. All right, Kongo Blunt's down but not out here. Yeah, this is super winnable, actually, because Ryu's so explosive. Yeah, especially with Rage. And, oh, you know, he's really, I won't say, one thing I will definitely say about Kongo Blunt is he's definitely got D12's number, where D12 is really trying to catch those landings up tilt, and he's just focusing right through it. He doesn't care. Oh, but his shield. Oh, now. Yeah, 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 I saw him go go right, and I'm corner. like, yeah. All right, all right. So now I think it's not Coco Blunt's has counterfeit. Yeah, Coco so Blunt's got his have to go to one of these stages that he's super uncomfortable in. He can choose I think it, one that he's better on. Yeah, I think if I didn't see that, if we didn't see that SD on uh, Coco Blunt's second stock, I think that would have been uh, his game right there. That's true. That's true. He seems to be holding Gonna run it back to PS2. Nice. So let's see what we got going on here. Both game indeed. All right. If this had been six. Yeah, definitely. Let's see what uh, he's got here. On PS2, yeah, that makes sense. Both characters are pretty happy with PS2 here. So. Multi parry right there. Yep. Just zone him, yeah. Just zone him. He doesn't have to get. He knows he doesn't have to get close. Snake has such good Oh, the wow. focus. The damage. Nice. He's at 80. That's big, that's yeah. big damage. You've got to get him to where, like, the, the short you can combo is still, you know? Which might be now, honestly, depending on when they start. I think it is. Pokeballs has such good patience in the zoning. Yeah. Oh, there's the focus, but no punish. I think you actually would have been too far away, Snake Dash Attack. Yeah, Snake Dash Attack goes real far. All right, more grenades on stage. Yep. Zoning away once again. Originally, uh, Coco Blunt was winning the zoning board. Oh, oh, but that's C4. 70 something. He was below 80%. Coco Blunt really has not had the presence of mind here for those C4s. That's oh, D12. <laughs> Ran out of invincibility if the grenade put him out. That might be, he might actually be good on that very soon. Back in the corner, and again, like Coco Bones was winning that zoning war for a little bit. Now that D12's got himself established with the grenade, he feels like he's gotten into a rhythm. So what, we'll see how Coco Bones deals with the new, the new zone if he can get through it. Tatsu, but the it trade invincibility on Snake Dash Attack? Come on! They roll away. Oh, there's the Tatsu there. All right, I got a little upset on my boy's behalf, <laughs> but come on, really? Right, you got, you got really? This. He's stuck. He's stuck. Oh, yeah, I did, did damage in the Tapped shield, the actually, the snake. That's crazy. He was at 160. Don't act like he was dying right in there. Oh, oh, got back. No, no down smash. Okay. It has the oh, right in. Oh, oh, my God. God. Oh, oh, my. Holy silence. What did I just see? Wow. Oh my lord, that, that was disgusting. Too. The recovery was so nice. Alright, Coco Blunts is feeling himself. If I was if I was D12 right there, if that happened to me, I'd be scared shitless. Yeah, this is crazy. <laughs> oh, but the grenade trade. Oh, oh the weight! 
the he way, charged it bro. and went for the first pull because he knew D12 wanted an up tilt. So he said, yeah. I'm not going to air dodge into your up tilt like you know you, you, know, you want me to. I'm going to wait here and you're going to come towards me. No down smash. No up tilt either. Okay, going to roll out of that pressure. Yeah. And now yeah. Reset back to neutral, but the C4 oh. again. He's alive, though. He really just... The front side. He's got it. What are you doing, man? Is that an accidental taunt? I hope it so. It had to be. There's no that, way. That was really great taunt. That would have been the most raw thing ever if you just read that. Oh, he's not going to platform tech chase me. I just saw him. <laughs> I got All right. Up, All right. Get last stock here. Last stock, last game. This is really good. Yeah, this is going This is going to the limit here. It's good that it is. Oh, my real lord. Hard. Oh, Another but one. the C4, man. Just really. Oh, They're just trading damage now. Oh, no focus. Down tilt. Snake down tilt is stupid. Two parries in a row. Grenade exploding. Yeah, grenades exploding. All right. Lots of grenades exploding again. D12's grenade usage has been pretty insane. They're both at high percent, but I think yeah. Pokemon's at up tilt percent here, right? So like he definitely is. He has to be very. You gotta be very careful. That's why he's gonna throw out a lot of these zoning projectiles. But yeah. we'll see. Oh, nice. Okay, this is big for him. D12 air dodges into the grenade. Yeah, and he really does not want to be in the same. And he's up tilted. Yeah, 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 yep, yeah. That's gonna be it. Oh. That was what I was trying to avoid with that. Yeah. 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 Good All right. That was a All long right, it's game. time. That was good. It's time. Hey Ace. You gonna commentate? I have to. I have to play. You do. Which is the main reason I have to I play against. Commentating. I have to play against probably my least favorite matchup, which is any heavy. Why do I don't care if I win. I hate playing against them. All right, all right. All right. Look at luck, this. boys. What I want to commentate. You're gonna be disappointed in me. I, I guarantee not. you. My like, homie's gonna I do win, well. You're gonna be disappointed. No, you're gonna. Do, no, he's gonna be good. You guys just wait. He's too humble. Gotta pop off. All right, Zaddy versus Scrungo. Potentially the greatest set in this entire tournament, at least for me. Well, Zaddy's got a much deeper character.